What do fires, grapes, red underwear, paper mache dolls, and men dressing up as women all have in common? They are all part of the New Year's traditions in Ecuador. Hola. Bienvenidos a Ecuador. I decided to travel to Baños, one of the popular cities for adventure enthusiasts, to bring in the New Year and experience these unusual traditions. If you want to engage in some of these Ecuadorian traditions like I did, there are a few things you might want to buy in order to prepare for it, one of which is a managote. There is a huge tradition in Ecuador that on New Year's Eve, when the clock strikes 12, you burn these dolls, which they call manigotes, and they're made of paper mache. And basically the idea of it is that you are burning Año Viejo, the past year, this last year. You're burning all of your regrets. You're burning things that went wrong, things that you did not like, things that you wish could have been better. The Monagotes are often male figures ranging from cartoon characters to superheroes to unpopular politicians. So you, you can use any old clothes, you put paper inside, put another clothes and after put the head. Some of the dolls are stuffed with old clothes and paper and then thrown into the fire to erase away all the bad memories of the past year and start the new year with a clean slate. The next thing a woman needs to buy is a pair of colored underwear. A tradition in Ecuador for New Year's is for the women to either wear a pair of yellow or red underwear. The yellow, amarillo, means for prosperity, for money, and the red is for, for single women to find love. Este, ah. para mucho amor. M mucho amor. Um, yes. Much uh -huh. love. Yes. Esta, mucho dinero. Mucho dinero. Poco dinero. Poco dinero? Yes. Little dinero. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> yes? Yes. Uh, amor, amor y dinero. dinero. Yes. Yeah. Okay. One, una y yeah. una. Yeah. Okay. So you can wear both pairs at the same time, I just found out. So you can have prosperity, money, and love. Okay. Quiero amor y dinero. Quiero amor y dinero. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And the last thing you'll need to buy are some grapes, 12 grapes to be exact. Another one of the New Year's Eve traditions in Ecuador is to eat 12 grapes. It's one for every month and it brings some kind of luck as well. Yo compro, yo compro uva. Beautiful. One for every month, and with each grape, you make a wish. Now for the quirkiest of Ecuador's New Year's traditions. So these men, who are straight, mind you, they dress up in women's clothes, and they go around from person to person, and car to car, and business to business, and they are basically hustling and dancing for money. So they go up to people on the street, they go, they block cars, they dance, get on top of cars, they uh, do all kinds of crazy stuff to entertain the people in order to get some money from them. I followed around two guys and their friends to learn about the meaning of this odd tradition and see how it all takes place. I even helped them to get ready. The idea behind this is that they are widows, or viudas in Spanish, who've recently lost their husband, so they are in need of money to pay for their funerals and survive throughout the upcoming year.
Now, in modern days, the widows will dress up, climb onto cars, dance seductively, and just have fun and act silly in order to get a few coins from the unbothered spectators. crazy tradition and these guys sometimes from what I'm hearing come come off with a couple hundred dollars which then they use to party with really cool though and lots of fun it's all about having fun so I still have my money gold day tucked safely in my backpack those are those are his feet the celebrations continued into the night. Then finally, after hours of dancing and collecting money, the clock struck midnight and it was time to burn the monogotes and say goodbye to this past year's trouble. <laughs> <laughs> The festivities continued into New Year's Day, and I was invited to attend my new friend's family New Year's Day gathering. It was filled with dancing, music, and a new viuda. Happy New Year or Feliz Año Nuevo.